I don't know, man. Shouldn't have let her handle this project. She has too many feelings. <laughs> Girls have too many feelings. You know, they are sensitive, emotional, and indecisive. By the way, why are we talking about this? I'll come back later. Okay. Okay, bye. Um, hey, do you mind? Hmm. Please. Uh, hey, can I help you with something? Uh, no. Hey, what did you mean by girls are sensitive, emotional, indecisive? can do anything other than dress nicely and cook food for their husbands. I didn't say the last part. Might as well do. Your words are just nicer, smarter way to refer to the same thing. You know what? I gotta go. Hey, where are you going? Probably somewhere else insulting other people with my horrible misogynistic comment. Wanna take a one? Bye. Oh. Oh, what? Yesterday I was disturbing you, but I can't help it, you know. You should not generalize women like that. In other situation, I might have easily agreed with you, but yesterday's whole conversation just proved my point. What? How so? First of all, you came up to me because you're offended of my comments that you do not even know the context of. It is emotional and sensitive. Second. I asked you if you need something, but you said no and keep going away. That is indecisive. Okay, that's unfair. Are you one of these feminists that are, that's always mad about everything? No, I'm not. I'm not a feminist. You sound like what? That's another stereotyping. You know, just because you fit into one criteria doesn't mean you are in that category, right? I mean, I'm studying in mining engineering which is in male criteria, but also I wear dress, heel. Besides, I don't like the term. It is restricting and somehow divisive. People are fighting for other types of equality. Why separate ourselves with other people who fight for basically the same cause, right? Intersectional feminism. What? There is a term for that called intersectional feminism. It basically deals with multidimensional intersecting social identities like gender, race, social class, nationality, etc. It pushes other types of equality, as you put it. Oh. But still feminism. Also, you understand feminism, right? Probably more than you do. Nice. I think you need to stop picking people like this. Yeah. Hi. I purposefully came here a bit later to avoid you, but yeah, here you are. What a coincidence. Okay, so um, what's your deal? You seem like an angry, threatened, misogynist, man child, but I'm not. The sexist comment you said on the phone with your friend seemed out of the character. I don't know. Probably the fact that men are facing similar mistreatment with women. Women are keep talking about wage gap, while no one ever talk about how men expected to do lower paying jobs like construction and waste collection. Women are tough if they have short haircut and men are suddenly weak if they let out a Okay, easy guys. That kind of discrimination happens toward women since centuries ago. Well, it just so happens they are living this century. Plus, if I complain, I'm suddenly like a misogynist in time. Oh wow, never thought about it that way. Uh huh. I think men are not weak if they cry. Quite the 
the opposite actually. But you are still sensitive, emotional, and indecisive. Hey, you are sensitive and emotional. Bring your heart out in the middle of this empty coffee shop. <laughs> but that is not necessarily a bad thing. Yeah, men and women can be sensitive and emotional if they want to. 